Hey, what's up guys and welcome back to Ask NK. This is a quick rundown of Blender assets and add-ons that you probably missed. And this week, we have a couple of interesting things that you guys will definitely want to see. Starting off, we're looking at the free Chappy 3D model and this is coming from Vito. It is worth mentioning that Vito is a 17 year old Blender user and he has been creating amazing things with Blender. This is his most recent work and it is three variations of Chappy 3D model, which comes in as a fully rigged model, fully textured, and comes with a huge set of things that you might want to do with it. So for those who are thinking about getting this 3D model, it is worth knowing that you have access to three different prototypes of the model that you can tweak and play with. And you might also want to know that these models are totally available for free and you can download them right now and start doing some stuff. And for those who like to support this artist, you might want to also take a look at his Gumroad where he has the overgrown environment asset pack that comes in extremely handy, especially for those who like grungy assets and are looking for models that are exactly like this to make some very nice designs. So for those who are also thinking about joining his Patreon, he has a couple of other assets like Nefgon and also some camera packs that you might also want to consider taking a look at and all these things are totally available and I'm going to put these links in the description so you can do well to check it out. And it's very interesting to see that we have very young Blender users creating amazing stuff like this. The Lego generator is coming from the folks at Digital Pottery. So the last time we talked about Digital Pottery, we looked at a couple of works that they've made. That includes the rope generator, we looked at the engine generator, the string wire generator, the tire generator, the crystal generator, all the way down to the blender pillow generator, which is dope. But right now we are seeing the Lego character generator. So the Lego character generator uses the geometry node and it simply allows you to create Lego character pieces. So there's a couple of variations that you have here and you can randomize these to create thousands of Lego character pieces in a couple of clicks. And for those who are thinking about getting these ones, or maybe you want to get any of the other generators that folks at Digital Pottery has made before, links to this is going to be in the description. So do well to check it out. So most times you might want to export some of your assets from Blender over to Unity. And the beautiful thing with this add-on is that it allows Steam members to batch export certain files as it makes use of Blender's FBX and GLTF support to export all of these things out of Blender. So if you've been wondering about how you can export things, instead of exporting your assets one after the other, you might want to rely on the batch export add-on, which you can totally get for free to get this job done for you. Cory Koza is a beautiful Blender developer that has made two nice add-ons. So we're looking at the Top Bar Pi and also the Light Manager. So if you're into working with snaps, proportions, you know, you would like to have a pie menu that offers all of this instead of going through the menus to get these things done, then this Top Bar Pi menu is one that you might want to consider looking at. But then if you're into working with lights and you like to manage these lights yourself, you want to control how the lights gets to work, you want to have a property bar that you can easily access within the end panel, then the light manager, which you can totally get for free, is also something else that makes a lot of sense. So Curry has made all of this available and it looks pretty nice and I would definitely suggest that you go ahead and check this out. If you're Blender 3D shading artist, you might want to take a look at Astrid's Toolbox from Vexta Street. So the beautiful thing about Astrid's Toolbox is these are sets or collections of Blender 3D shader nodes that have been grouped together to help Blender shading artists work better. This isn't the only thing that you can get from Vexta Street, as if you also go over to the Vexta Street page, you'd notice that the holographics is also here, which is something you can test out if you like to get the free one. So you can test this out first off and see what you can do with it, as this is a custom Blender shader that is built to simulate stylized irradiance or a thin film interference. So if you're Blender artist and you're into shading and you're looking for a shader that has a texture override, a distortion, a vibrance override and also a max inversion, which is now something that you can get with a 2.0 version, you can simply come right here and test this out and start working with it. And finally for this week, we are looking at the Vox toolset. In most cases, you might be looking for a voxel editor or maybe a tile generator. And this is where the Vox toolset comes in very handy. So this Blender Geometry Node tool allows you to create voxels and you can also use this to build words depending on what you want. This comes with a couple of tools that you can use to customize your voxel scene or your map scene however you want. And it comes with a Blender example asset alongside with demo tile sets that you can pick up and start working with. So this is more like it. For those who like to get this, links to this is going to be in the description. So do well to check it out. 
But before we go, there are a couple of Blender add-ons that are currently doing a 25% off just in case you like to get this. One of them is an EV production suite from the folks at New Media Supply. So we've talked about this beautiful add-on, did a couple of demos, and this add-on is just super cool. Right now, they are doing a 25% off, which is running from now till the 29th of April. And they're not the only ones doing this, as we also have the folks at True VFX doing a 35% slash on all of their products. So I did reach out to the creators to confirm how the best way is to get this to work. And the best way is to go to Blender Market via the incognito mode on your browser and enter the coupon code TrueCrease during checkout. And this is going to give you 35% off and this is running from now till the 30th of April of 2022. So this is more like it. So for those who like to get the free choppy model or probably you're into pie menus, light management, you would like to get some free Lego assets, then links to all of these are definitely going to be in the description. So do well to check it out. And of course, if you like this video or you learned something from it, you can go ahead and give a like and don't forget to share with a friend. And until I see you guys in the next one, peace.